work together to, to define some kind of strategy of response from the Muslim community to look at HIV AIDS within that community. And, 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 and so it was part of that, that group. And what came out of that was, you know, an opportunity to do more. I think we ended up as a group looking at HIV AIDS in the Muslim community. We designed and produced a brochure and we had a community forum that really reached out to the wider community and we did really, really well. But after that, what, right? And um, the opportunity to be part of this CHAMP study where, where additional training can be had, could be had, um, meeting with other people around the whole notion of so- social justice and, 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 and speaking about AIDS to communities and community members was important. And that was the invitation that I got to be part of that, that CHAMP study. It taught me that people can come together unanimously to work on the same cause, regardless of where they come from, their, their, what social status they have here in Canada. And I think it's very important since CHAM brings together people from like faith leaders like yourself, media, and PHAs just to work together. Because sometimes the stigma that's out there, it enclose the people in a hole that I think they're not feel liberated. They don't feel proud of themselves and they don't feel like they can go out in the community and be themselves just because they're HIV positive.